Today guys we get a new mini event and many changes in terms of weapon buffs and a few other bits and bobs to go through in today's hotfix. This is the 6th of August 2020. Let's go people. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and today I bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you do want to see more. Also, before we go any further, for all your gaming needs, no matter the platform you play it on, at amazing prices and incredible weekly deals, check out G2A, link to within that video description. Okay, so the hot fix which lands today, actually by the time you've watched this video, it's probably already applied to your platform of choice in which you play on. It's the 6th of August 2020, so let's go. Today in Borderlands 3, the bonus bar salute mini event begins and we address some reported player concerns. These changes and the accompanying event will be live on all platforms by 12pm PST. Obviously to apply hotfixes wet the main menu until you see that sign that says hotfixes are applied. And with this hotfix the Echo Cast Overload mini event comes to an end and is replaced with the Borderlands 3 Anniversary Celebration Bonus Boss Loot Event. During this event players have an increased chance of legendary loot dropping from bosses. This event will be live until August 13th at 9am PST, where we will switch it to Loot Monster Mayhem mini event with next week's hotfixes. Okay, so getting into the hotfixes applied today. Discount the listed item of the day in the Veteran Woods machine. Updated the Beastmaster's interplanetary stalker skill, so that weapon damage is affected by big game while using the Cosmic Stalker class mod. Added tags to punk enemies to mark them as humanoid. Addressed a reported concern where the gunner would lose bonuses from sleeping giants after entering Iron Bear. Addressed a reported concern that switching mayhem levels could cause some areas to spawn more iridium than intended. Disabled the ability for enemy adds to spawn infinitely during a King Bobo fight. Okay, so weapon changes. We've seen significant improvements to performance after the adjustments made to projectile weapons in the previous patch. Today brings a set of changes to various pieces of gear that were negatively impacted by those necessary changes without sacrificing the stability of the game. We have also included a few buffs to other pieces of gear that we felt needed attention as well. Lead Sprinkler increased weapon damage. Reflux increased the chance for projectiles to chain. Brainstormer increased the chance for projectiles to chain. Hyperfocused increased weapon damage. Carrier increased weapon damage. Unseen Threat increased the damage of homing bullets with critical hits. Wagon Wheel increased weapon damage. Bearcat lowered the ammo cost from 4 to 3. Rowan's Cool increased accuracy. Lucian's Cool reduced the spread of projectiles and increased weapon damage. That'd be one to actually test that. It's an interesting weapon. King's Cool and Queen's Cool have received a damage buff too. Amazing. King's Boom increased weapon damage. Complex Root decreased weapon charge time. Moonfire increased rate of fire. Fastball increased grenade damage, Mongol increased weapon damage, and Cutsman increased weapon damage. And that is actually it for the hotfix people which they go into. Actually some great changes there for sure. Definitely curious to find out about the King and Queen's Cool, the Lucian's Cool, the Mongol and the Cutsman. So I may bring you a video with my thoughts on the changes to these individual weapons, but we will see. Well yeah guys, that is it for the hotfix for today, the 6th of the 8th, 2020. That is the 6th of August, 2020. Let me know your thoughts on the changes down below in that comment section. But on that note guys, we have come to the end. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like, it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And as always, people turn on those notifications so you never miss a video I upload. But again, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.